Today I'm going to be doing a haul video on this haul is from this week and last week. Um, and a few of the things, um, I remember the prices of them, but I took the tags off just because I actually wore a couple of them to, uh, I like orientation and picture day and stuff, so I wore a couple things. But anyway, um, I went shopping at mainly PacSun, Hollister, Abercrombie, American Eagle, and then I had one shirt from this store called Spencer's. And then also, besides like all this, I'm going to have a part two of this video because I actually bought more stuff online, um, I think Monday or Tuesday, and those should be coming in sometime next week. And I got 10 shirts on together. I got a couple from Pax on a couple from a store called Tilly's. So anyway, I'm just going to get into this. Um, and I was to start off by showing the first thing. It's not anything to do with clothing, but it is something I bought at the mall. But anyway, like if you saw my... Uh, skincare routine I was talking about. I was going to buy any moisturizer, but the same brand and stuff. Just try out something else. But anyway, from the store Nordstrom, I got more of the Kiehl's Facial Fuel, and this is the SPF 15 one. And what this is, is just moisturizer, and this is in the 4.2 fluid ounce, and as you can see, it's from Nordstrom. But um, this was, I know it was the exact price of it was like $37 plus change. So it was a little bit expensive, but this is very good moisturizer, and if this size is too big for you, there's also a 25, or a 2.5 fluid ounce one that's around, I think, $25 plus tax, and I think this one was like $35 plus tax, so just might look out for that one. I talk more about that in my skincare routine if you want to find out more about this. But anyway, the next one is, I'm going to show stuff, if, sorry if it's a little bit random because I just shove stuff in bags and stuff, so if it's not the right order, I'm sorry. But this first shirt is from PacSun, and it's just this white, gray, black, white, I already said white, and red um, shirt that's from PacSun. It's DC. I don't have the tag for this one because I, I like bought this last week and I wore it once. Um, but I remember the price of this. It was $24.99, so it's just this shirt right there. So there's that. Then the next shirt, I got this one yesterday, so it does have the tag on it, and it's just this mint green shirt, which I really, really like. I, I was like contemplating whether to buy this or not, but I decided why not, because I really like the color, and I like the shirt too. And it just says New York on it, and Cali well, Cali, but California, and it's just like that. I like this shirt so much, and it's in the brand Diamond. I never bought that brand before, but I like this shirt, and it was $30, if you can see that. Then the next shirt, well, shorts are also from PacSun, and they're just these plain white shorts in the brand Volcom, and the only thing that you can, like, that's not plain about them is um, right at the very bottom of the back of the shorts, so just a little summer right here in, like, dark gray Volcom sign, but I was looking all over the store, like, all of these stores and stuff to try to, like, find a pair of white shorts, because I could not find one anywhere, but I finally found these at the last minute, and these were $44.50. And then the next shirt is again from Pax Sun, and this is just in the brand RVCA, and it's I, you can't really tell on camera. It looks a little bit weird, but um, the RVCA part is actually like a greenish color, but it looks kind of gray on the camera. And then the shirt's gray, and this was twenty eight dollars. The next shirt again from Pax Sun is. A Vol the Volcom brand, it's just gray, and it says Volcom in like a blue color, as you can tell. And the price of this was $24.50. Then the next shirt is from Abercrombie and & Fitch. And I got two of these shirts, so on the same day, but this was last week. But it's just this red polo, and it just has a, like a dark blue mousse on it. And it has, yeah, and this was in... It cost $60. And then I got the same exact shirt in a second, which we'll see, I guess, it's in another bag. But I wore that to um, picture day, so that's the reason why that tag's off. But anyway, just getting back to stuff. Sorry, it's like jumbled down and stuff. But these shorts are from, they're just these like mint green color, like a dark mint green pair of shorts from American Eagle. And they're in the prep length. Um, I'm not sure if they... If they still have these. Like, I went there today and I didn't see them, but I got these last week. So, I don't know if it's just, like, a... I don't know if they have them or not still, but I just got these last week. And these were... I, I'm pretty sure these were $29.99. I don't have to tag for this because I wore them last week as well. But, there's just that. 
Then the next shirt I got yesterday, and it's just this Hollister polo, and it just has a red seagull on it, and this was $29.50. And the next shirt's again from Hollister, and it's just this red crew neck with a red seagull on it, and it was $19.50. The next shirt, again from Hollister, is a blue crew, ne uh, crew neck, and it just has a red seagull. It's the same exact one as the red one, um, and this one's again nineteen fifty. You can see. Then the next shirt. Well, actually, I'll show my underwear real fast. Um, I actually took the underwear out of the packaging just so I could see if it fit. But here's like the little thing for it, and it's in the athletic trunk. But I just got a pair of green, and then a pair of red, and these are twelve fifty each. But I know it's buy one get one. No, it's like buy two. It's buy one for twelve fifty, buy two for twenty. And like I said, it's just athletic trunk. Looks like that. Then the next things are from Abercrombie again. I think I showed Abercrombie stuff already. I'm not sure. But it's just this white, regular Abercrombie shirt, and it has just a dark blue moose on it. It's a crew neck as well. So my nose keeps on itching. Um, but it's just $24. Then the next shirt, again for Abercrombie, is just dark blue and blue stripes with the dark blue moose on it, as you can see. And this was $30. Then the next shirt... This is one I kind of regret buying. I don't know if I'm going to take it back or not, but it's just this Mac Miller shirt I got, because I had another Mac Miller shirt, but it was, like, wearing out, so I just got another one. And this is from the store Spencer's, um, and this was $19.99. Then the next shirt is from PacSun again, and it's just the, it's called, in, the brand's called Enjoy. Looks like that's, like, a grayish-blue color, but the price of this was... Twenty six fifty. Oh, sorry. Twenty six fifty. Next shirt. This is one I wore for um, picture day, but I got the same day as a red one. But this one is this another blue Abercrombie shirt, and it has a dark blue moose on it. And this was again, I think it said sixty dollars. And then the last, this is the last thing I bought. I think this is the last thing. Um, it's just this green shirt from Abercrombie, and just has a white moose on it. And again, this is in a crew neck, and it was $30. So I'm pretty sure that's all the stuff I got. I don't see anything else. But, um, that all I got? yeah, that's all I got. So that's all I got so far. But like I said, I'll make a part two video just because I'm getting more stuff in our, sometime, I'm guessing around Tuesday or Wednesday just because I ordered stuff the other day from PacSun and Tilly's, like I said. But that's basically it. Um... Also, if it seems like I've been buying, like, usually I, I'm buying stuff weird. Like, I don't know if you saw my room tour because you can see some of the clothes I have. But I was buying a lot of stuff from Abercrombie and Hollister recently for some reason. But I'm trying to get more Hollister stuff because I recently applied at Hollister. So hopefully I'll get a job there. And I, like, I applied there on the 7th, which was my birthday. And they seemed, like, really, like, en like enthusiated, is it enthusiastic, actually, that I was, like, applying. Because they said, like, they need a worker and stuff like that. So I actually have an interview with them tomorrow. So... I'm thinking I might do, like, a little video on interviewing there, like, what the kind of stuff they ask. And it's, if you're, like, interviewing yourself, like, you know what to expect kind of thing. But, like I said, I might hopefully get a job there. So I'm trying to, like, stock up on some Hollister stuff. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I get that job there. But basically, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And I hope this gave you a little bit of tips or ideas on what you might want to buy just for, like, this school year. Um, and... If you forgot, I will, like, write down the, um, the stores, or I'll write in the comment, or not the comment, the down bar, I'll write down the stores and stuff that I got everything at. Um, so, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you guys later. Alright, bye.